everybody, how you all doing? It's Jake here. Today I'm going to be continuing my playthrough of GTA 3 Definitive Edition. Um, this past video, I've done all the jobs for Luigi Gotorelli, the uh, Leone family made man who owns Luigi Sex Club 7, and now I'm going to be doing jobs for Joey Leone, the Don's son, who, well, he's not technically part of the Leone crime family. He doesn't want to be part of organized crime, he just wants to do, like, petty thefts and whatnot, but... Anyway. And this is my favorite mission this entire game. In a moment, sweetheart. I got a little business to take care of. I got a little job for you, pal. The Ferrelli brothers have owed me money for too long and they need to be taught some respect. Lips Ferrelli is stuffing his fat face in the St. Mark's Bistro, so steal his car and take it to Eight Ball's bomb shop up in Harwood. You know Eight Ball, right? Once he's fitted it with a bomb, go park the car where you found it. Then sit back and watch the whole show. But hurry up, he won't be eating forever. Yeah, he said Ferrelli brothers instead of the Ferrelli crime family. That's because the Ferrellis... Well... The crime family's basically been disbanded. They've already lost their influence because of the events of Vice City. And what was left of the Frelight crime family has been shattered after the events of San Andreas. <clears throat> More on that when I start streaming those. where I gotta drive extra carefully. So if I put even a scratch on it, my clips is gonna know that's the most important. Yeah, an eight ball. He was a guy that I escaped police custody with after the cartel captured the old oriental gentleman. Alright. Sorry, I've been clearing my throat. It's about February, and you know, it's a point of winter where it's about to turn into spring in about a month or so, and uh, I body just can't take it. You all know what it's like. I got really bad, you know, change in season allergies. Until you explode. That's ironic, right? Get that guy! God, there's always a cop right there. Borrowing this cap. around the world. In the past, there's been some criticism about our That's why I'm here at the Aeros Factory so you can meet some of them. Excuse me, sir. Do you <clears throat> Hey, 
can learn about the heiress company exploiting their workers. When you play this on your own. Farewell, Chunky Lee Chung. Chunky Lee Chung is pushing spank for some new gang from Columbia or Colorado or something. I'm not really sure. Who needs details? Anyway, he's got a noodle stand down in Chinatown. That rat has sold his last stir fry. I want you to take him out. If you need a piece, go around back of ammunition opposite the subway. Sort yourself with a nine. You know where it is, right? Well, remember, just watch your back in Chinatown. It's triad territory. There we go again, he's mentioned Spank, as I've told you before. It's a parody of crack cocaine. Don't threaten me with a good time. Oh yeah, and the triads? The Leones actually do... are still at a gang war with them. I'm not gonna pay $250 just for more pistol ammo. Anyway. And much early in the game. You know. Once I get to a certain point. Instant, I stepped into Chinatown. Yeah, I see right there, that's the Leon's opening firing on the triads. Because they are not buddies. Yeah, much later in the game, at a very early point in this game, actually. I think if I do enough missions for Tony Cipriani or for El Boro, one or the other, instant I step into Chinatown, the triads are going to open fire on me. Okay, we make oh, shit. shit. Ah, oh, you motherfucker. I know there's supposed to be a car chase. Turn that off. <clears throat> I guess doing things the easy way is for squares. I don't think he knows where he's going. No, my videos are not intended for children. I am gonna swear. Oh my god. Just roll off the fucking road. As long as I'm not swearing in the first 30 seconds of my video, or I'd be in deep shit. I only have 25 Uzi rounds. I ain't gonna waste them. I'm driving it like an ass.
how is he getting through that pole? Holy crap. That took way too long. All the other playthroughs I've played this, I didn't even let him get to his car. <clears throat> sure if I don't get a copyright claim for that one second of music. problems with the Mafia yet. I mean, I am going to have problems with the Mafia much later, but... But yeah, basically, throughout the game, you're going to get problems with every game. Oh, this one. Alright, we're going to hit the payroll van. It leaves the edge of Chinatown every day. Bullets won't even dent the van's armor, so get a car and ram it off the road. Now hit it hard, and the punk-ass security guard should bail. And take it to the warehouse at the docks, and my guys are gonna take over from there. Now it won't be doing its rounds all day, so don't hang around. You know what? This may take me a couple tries, but just because I'm gonna do this one strategy that I've seen on another video. All right. Okay, the triads haven't attacked me yet. I think I gotta wait till I'm doing missions for Tony Cipriani, and then they'll turn hostile towards me. What's that noise? Oh, shit. Shouldn't have gotten in my way. Okay, that one doesn't count. This is my real first try. Hey, get out of my way. Okay, I guess I'm just gonna have to beat the crap out of you. Oh. That doesn't work. Guess we'll just have to do it this way. Trouble. 
<laughs> Suspects in a red van. Still saying all this stuff as if I was bumping right into him. Once I get up here, the cops should fuck off pretty quick. Yeah, they stop following you once you get into the marker. <clears throat> I saw a health pickup over here, right? Either over here or near the the bitch and dog food factory. Oh, here it is. Cipriani chauffeur. Real sweet. She purrs, you know what I mean? Oh, here's the guy I was telling you about. All right, listen, this guy, he ain't Italian, and he's no mechanic, but he could get things fixed. This is Pop's capo, Tony Cipriani. Hey, I'm Tony Cipriani. Take him to Mama's restaurant in St. Mark's. All right. Now listen to me. I'm planning a job that needs a good driver, so drop by sometime later, okay? Okay, kid, drive me to the laundry in Chinatown first. I got a bit of business to take care of. Those washerwomen ain't been paying their protection money. And watch the car. Joey just fixed this junk heap. So no fancy crap, okay? Right on. Man, I actually wonder what happened to him between the events of Liberty City Stories, which is set in 1998, and this game, which is set in 2001, the year it came out. Because in Liberty City Stories, he used to be much thinner. Guessing, I'm guessing he just took a little too much criticism from his ma, because she was one of the people that pointed out how thin Tony was, and I guess he just let ma feed him a little too well. Wait here. Keep the engine running. This ain't a social. <clears throat> 
Oh yeah, and that's Michael Madsen, by the way. You might know him You're best as a uh, uh, Vic Vega, aka Mr. Blonde from Reservoir Dogs. out of here real quick. Stained clothes. Yeah, I mean, look at how much bigger he looks. Mafia Sentinel is actually a pretty fast vehicle, too. But for El Burro's mission, I'm going to steal a... Uh, I'm not going to do it right now. I'm going to steal a, a Diablo Stallion because that's pretty fast. Alright. Should give me some more shotgun ammo. Because this next job <clears throat> I need to take care of some stuff that skunk oh this beautiful one. just beautiful all right just the guy I need to talk to all right there's a car stuffed with a stiff at the cafe near Callahan Point one of the Ferrellis thought he was a wise guy, so he got what he had coming to him. Take the corpse to the crusher in Harwood, all right? Yeah, this may look easy on paper, right? You could tell that I've played this game a couple too many times if... If you know exactly why I'm complaining. If you're wondering why I'm complaining about certain issues. Hey. Oh yeah, Dead Skunk in the Trunk. That's a... I believe that's a line from Goodfellas. Oh yeah, that guy right there. waiting on me. Oh, what the fuck? Beautiful. Just beautiful. Fuck. A. Duck. Flash, flash, get the AO. Yeah, you can't hear that.
grabbing up on you. Yeah, I, this is the reason I hate this mission, because the Ferrellis will just keep bumping into you until they destroy your car. And no, they do not stop following you. Oops. Oh, that's what I, I just now noticed that. I just love this part. I'd be watching the show if there weren't people trying to flatten me with their cars. There we go. I think now that the mission's passed, it'll probably just piss off. Yeah. That's always fun, just watching cars. is you can sue anyone for pretty much anything and you'll probably win or at least get a settlement at the firm of Raken and Ponds our personal injury Joey. attorneys we can show you how falling down and howling like a sissy can result in a large damage award from your employer we also specialize in awards for injuries suffered in auto bus and train accidents and can even train you to throw yourself in front of a bus and pretend <clears> to be <throat> injured hey that's why they pay for insurance for that mission I'm gonna need to steal a four-door car What the hell am I hitting? Yeah, what the hell am I hitting? Nothing. Fucking invisible barriers and whatnot. Alright, the getaway. Yeah, I believe that's Joey Leone's last mission. What a ride she's gonna be, huh? Alright, listen. Get some wheels to the safe house at St. Mark's and pick up a few friends of mine. They're hitting the bank and they need a driver. I gave my word that you were the man, so don't screw this up. Get them to the bank before 5 o'clock, not a minute after. I remembered correctly. If I remember correctly, the pay should be pretty good for this mission.
just to the bank on the main drag. I pick up this police. Get a wanted level from that. So there we have everybody. That does it for uh, Joey Leone's mission. Um, looks like for the next one, for my next set of missions, I'll have a choice either do El Burro's Payphone missions, which is missions for the Diablos, or Tony Cipriani's missions. Might do Tony's next. Not quite sure. Maybe. Definitely have to do El Burro's missions um, before doing the before doing Asuka's mission, Sayonara Salvatore. Well. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like. It does help my channel significantly. Subscribe and hope you all have a good day.